What's up, nerds? It's your boy going down the list of all the infamous, famous, awesome, not so awesome, sword and sorcery medieval fantasy films that came out in the 80s and 90s to see which one is on your D&D movie list and which one is the best D&D movie ever made. This episode, Legend, with the immortal, amazing, awesome Tim Curry playing evil and Tom Cruise playing Tom Cruise. And further proof that Tom Cruise doesn't age and is probably a vampire is the fact that he looks exactly the same in this film as he does today. God love him. Um, so yeah, D&D film, not D&D film. Ridley Scott's not his best work, let's famous. Entire film filmed pretty much 90% inside a studio. Very few outside shots were done. Most of the film, if not all of the film, there's some question was filmed inside a studio, was, um, which was experimental at the time. Now, not so much because of green screens and everything. You could probably film an entire movie inside a studio. But at the time when Legend was made, it was pretty breakthrough that they filmed the entire movie or most of it inside a studio. Is it really? Yeah, Ridley Scott, of course, now regrets making it. Definitely says it's not his best work. It's a moody, it's dark, it's got an interesting soundtrack, it's got some great visuals, it's very pretty. Tim Curry playing the hell out of being evil, I mean, is worth it alone. But is it a D&D movie? Have you seen it? Is it on your list? What are you thinking? Where does Legend stand? Does it even count? Are you tired of me doing this yet? Let me know.